Like almost every novel Irvin Welsh has written since Train Spotting, everybody thought that filth couldn't really ever be made into a film. It was too transgressive, the tone was too difficult, and you'd never find someone to play the central character properly. So full credit to writer and director John Baird, who's brought this to the screen, and it's a wild success. At least partly because he's, you know, he's got James McAvoy to play the part, who I would have thought was too young, too good looking, too clean cut. But he inhabits this role as this bipolar Edinburgh cop who's addicted to sex and coke and drink, and he's utterly, utterly obnoxious. First of all, in the first half of the movie, he's outmaneuvering his colleagues, played by Jamie Bell and Imogen Poots, and a really great John Sessions. And the tone is very sort of uh, not quite real. There's a sort of fantastical element to it. And it's just fun that he's just transgressing all over the place and having a great time. But then these cracks start to appear. And every now and again, wham, you get a hit of emotion and you realise it's going in a new direction. It's beautifully handled by the director. It's mesmerisingly performed by James McAvoy. It's fun and it's got this emotion as well. It's a huge success.